Good morning, Christopher. Hey, good morning, Marcus. How are you doing this morning? Very well yourself. I'm doing good, thank you, my friend. So, welcome here to Rana Park, just east outside of Pretoria. Thank you very much. It's an honor and a pleasure. Thank you for the invitation. It's really well appreciated. So, gentlemen, yes, here we are. Um, today we're going to be shooting air rifle. The Texan 45, it's actually in 457 caliber. We're going to be doing a 198 grain bullet, roughly at about three, um, 900 foot a second. As you can see, um, we, we have big open areas. Um, it's, it's well overcast, it's wet. And um, Mar Marcus, what's on the menu? A blue Villabiers, the Blaise Book, what's, yes. left, what's left on, on the quota for the season? I got some blow the beers, nice blow the beers, nice bliss box. We got a available still. Let's let's see if we can do that. Yeah. Traps, so, a bit go. a bit more on this later. So let's go hunt. Let's go do this.
るほど
Just took a shot at about 120, 120 yards. It was a frontal shot, and um, it then spun around and, and got moving. And here's the track. So we're tracking it, um, and we believe it is in this tall grass, about 150, 200 meters further on. So let's keep tracking it. If we see this slight movement still just in front of us, about 10 paces away, um, it's that uh, black fuller beast that we shot. So let's just give it its, its final, final moment and then we'll walk up to it. Thank you very much, Marcus. What a job, chaps. What a job. Beautiful animal. Beautiful. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Christopher, congratulations again. Thank you very Most much, Marcus. Beautiful animal. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Well, you know, when we started out, when we started out early this morning, um, keep in mind we arrived here at 6 as we can see it's um, it's overcast and it's wet very wet um, I, I think we had I think we had a, a tough hunt yeah. right tough hunt and um, eventually in, in, remember we we initially started out with the, with a blue villa beast but we just could not get under that 180 200 um, uh, meter range and uh, then we moved on to uh, other species and eventually we got this beautiful uh, black dollar beast. Thank you very much. Thank you for the opportunity. You're most welcome. I must say, I had, being my first time with a rifle, I had a little bit of my doubts. Of course, yes. But just once again showed that the right spot, sh shot placement is so important. Yes. And bringing down one of the toughest animals that I know. Absolutely so. You know, I've seen I've I've seen these animals with similar shots surviving 375 Holland and Hollands and, and 306s etc. Of course, we need to keep in mind that after the shot, um, you know, one just needs to have that little patience. You know, the five or the ten minutes just to give it time to settle. And um, the fact of the matter is, one bullet, one shot, and here we are. Exactly. Absolutely. Okay. So, guys, we were shooting the. Um, the Texan 45, actually a 457, and we were using a 189 grain bullet, and it was roughly at about 900 feet a second, maybe 19, 910 feet a second. The shot was about 120 paces, maybe a, a bit further, and um, I, I believe that penetration was ample. So, guys, all, all in all, I think in this beautiful beautiful day that we had out. I am absolutely privileged to be here. Once again, congratulations Chris. Thank you very much my friend. Pleasure. It's appreciated. Thank you. Thank you, man. Yes, now for the soup. So, chaps, yes, there we are. 
Thank you very much. At the end, at, at the end of a brilliant day here at Rhino Park, um, it's been an interesting day. It's been a long day. It's been a challenging day. I think the results are, are excellent. I think the rifle performed um, uh, to everyone's amazement and astonishment. Um, I like this facility. I think it's a perfect venue for a day hunt, day and night hunt. Um, <clears throat> and I think it's a concept that, that's now taking off in, in the city. You know. um, but Rhino Park also caters for um, uh, other outdoor adventure um, activities. There's motocross and enduro. There's, um, there's a private runway just up. There's 4x4. Four four. And, and what else do you guys do? Well, lately we're using these grounds for festivals. Um, we're hosting the guys from Speed and Sound doing race, private races on the track. We also just right behind us is a lovely restaurant for family. Oh, yeah. Even if you just want to come out for the day, enjoy, have a bra here, come use the restaurant, everybody's more welcome. Um, the accommodation we'll be using tonight is one of the ones that we are renting out for the night. And can I just say it's absolutely split? Yeah, it is. Um, with the venue right behind it, where you can have your party, where you can have your function, whatever you need to have. And it's really literally a walk away just to go have a split. So guys, there you have it. 3,000 hectares just outside Victoria, literally 15-20 minutes drive. Make use of it. It is absolutely great. So chaps, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thanks for coming.